Um, I actually am probably at the stage now of questioning why, um, why they ended up with that option. Um, oh, it kind of depends on what the team's playing and what team's playing as well. Um, but even when it is the team that I'm supporting, I'm still trying to probably rationalise why they've done it um, or figure out why and that still might not agree with it, but I can, uh, then I reinforce why I don't agree with it and I might reinforce my pictures or my process. Um, but sometimes I just trying to enjoy the game as well <laughs> rather than looking at what exactly the ref's done. Uh, I kind of do hand signals and then, like, you know, turn to whoever's watching the telly as well and just kind of like, oh, why'd they make that call? Like, you know, I saw it this way. Do you know what? I My first reaction is like, huh. Oh. I'm not sure I would have done that. And then I kind of think through their decision process. I, I try very hard not to be critical because I wouldn't want them to be critical of, of me. And usually I would, I may well know them as well, but either way, they're part of that bigger refereeing team. And I also know that there is a process and other things that have gone around that. And sometimes if I do know them and I haven't understood, I might just ask what their decision-making process was there because uh, really I'm interested in to, as to how they came to that decision, I, I don't, I would never, never critique, critique them, even if I feel I would have made a different decision in the moment.